we've managed to put a group of people together to just start documenting some of these old llamas because uh, we felt that it was an important time. The project became much vaster, you know, in other words, it became looking at the situation with the Tibetans. There seemed to be a need to try and document material for them as well, to document their own culture. Because that was 1984 and Jeff was already thinking about um, starting a trust. I came up with um, Meridian Trust from uh, thinking about the, um, the Meridian lines on the globe and that we would be um, the Meridian at which this transition of knowledge between East and West would take place. Everyone got involved just completely from the heart. We heard from His Holiness that um, he felt that what we should really be looking at was to um, archive, what well, to film and archive uh, the lamas that had come out of Tibet who had brought their oral tradition with them. His Holiness was very clear that we had to cover all the four major schools of Tibetan Buddhism as well as the Bun tradition and he in fact um, gave us himself a list of the teachers that he felt it would be very good for us to video, giving their re the teachings for which they were really famous, and the commentaries for which they were really famous. About, I think about six, seven, eight hundred hours maybe, together was filmed around that time of teachers. Um, and all of those, I think all except, I think, I think out of all the teachers that we filmed at that time, there's only one, there's only one that's still alive. Um, so it was really capturing something that was passing. You know, to me the most precious material we have is the early material, because no one else was filming in those days. No, when we, when we did initial filming, we didn't, it, you know, video, video equipment isn't like it is now. You know, we're not sitting there with a little camera and stuff. I mean, we were carrying bits of furniture with us. We did one of His Holiness's tours around Britain with pneumatic tapes, pneumatic machines. I mean, it was, we had to hire a big car and um, the equipment just took up so much space. I mean, and also when we were in recon, the cables were that thick. So not only does Meridian have 2,500 hours of teachings of these lamas and the culture of Tibet, but they've developed an extensive platform for digitizing and preserving and cataloging. This is, this is the end of a long, long journey to preserve um, all the material that we've filmed over the years. And it's, it's really exciting to think that we can now make it available to so many different audiences. Just a handful of people have seen this footage in the world. That's a treasure of the world. Uh, whatever is captured, it's so important to make sure that that's made available so these part of that Tibetan culture lives, you know. It will be very exciting for many, many, especially Tibetan people. Someone like my father, they, he never ever got the opportunity to see Dalai Lama in the Western country. It will be available to academics and students. It will be available to the Tibetans themselves, of course and laymans that want to learn more about uh, Tibetan Buddhism in particular and Buddhism in general. I think more and more people in China are re-engaging with their spiritual traditions so I think there will come a time in which um, appreciation of what the Tibetans actually have to offer will perhaps be more mainstream in China. And the opportunity is just tremendous to take the Dharma and teachings of the Buddha and bring him to the world in a way that has never been possible before. And it's going to be a tremendous gift. Now, looking back, I see what a treasure we've got. It's very unique. This is one of the only places where you could find not only some footage, but extensive footage. I think it's very important that the uh, Meridian Trust, that this group of Western people, mainly Western, because there's obviously you know, Tibetan people being involved all the way through in various ways, you know, really being involved. 
but that, the, that we're seen to fulfill a promise that we made um, to the Tibetans. To, this is for the Tibetan people. You know, this is. Um, it's very important.